shamed of what has happened to cricket at Kenya and they hope something happens. Now, moving on to shooting, the national shooting team is in South Africa and they are taking part in the championship as well as training for the World Championship, the I IPSC, which is happening in Thailand this year. Caroline Obuya followed the story for the team from the training to the armory where the, the gun shop where they went to buy guns as well as what they were eating and what should a shooter eat to ensure that they perform properly, especially in a shooting range. Welcome to Guns at Work shooting range. We are here in Gauteng, Johannesburg, South Africa. It's hot, extremely hot. You can't believe it. But we have here the top of the top, the top cream uh, shooters from Kenya who are preparing themselves for the upcoming World Championships in Thailand later this year. And I'm just going to talk to them. Tell me, what does it take to prepare for such a competition? Uh, yeah, we are, preparing, we are preparing for World Championship in Thailand. Uh, and we are training. We have uh, one of the top shooters here in South Africa, Zama Wanda, who is production. And we also have uh, one of our Kenyan top shooter, Rabat Nyamongo. He will shoot in standard. Uh, yes, we are preparing early for the championship. Shooting Association, Mr. Wandazama, welcome sir. Thank you. Tell me about the training that uh, you're conducting today. Uh, today we we have in Kenyans in South Africa after they finish their um, uh, level three nationals in Limpopo, they enjoyed it, but uh, they requested me to uh, assist them in preparation for the work that is coming up. So we are already starting uh, busy at work, focusing on what needs to be done, uh, taking lessons from what has happened in Limpopo, um, and a few Kenyans have performed very well. And uh, we are proud that uh, uh, our Kenyan brothers and sisters have supported and they're improving their skills. And then I'm here to assist them. The mindset has changed. It's no more South Africa International now. It's about Thailand, November. And this is a work in progress. What can you comment about the Kenyan team? They, they just concluded uh, the Popo Hand Nationals. The Kenyan team is a gem in the making. Um, the amount of talent uh, from the ladies to the general um, divisions of the likes of uh, Ibrahim, the likes of Robert, the likes of Semi and many others, and the ladies, uh, Muchiris and the uh, Belindas have uh, uh, Irene, and many of them, they've done uh, Kenya and South Africa and Africa very proud. It shows that the work that uh, we've been trying to assist them uh, in improving their um, uh, practical shooting IPSC skills have already gone into the uh, uh, right direction. I'm joined by these shooters as they go to shoot, do shopping. I'm finding out what do they buy, what do they need for these shooting spots. So come with me. So this is very easy to be able to pick your magazine during your magazine change and during your transition now uh, from a target to get a target when you're doing your magazine change. This is the latest Ipsic. Um, um, it's uh, the, the competition ring, really nice equipment right here. These are cartridge cases, they call them brass. After coming from the range, of course, when you're shooting, you normally pick them, but of course in Kenya we don't uh, collect brass. So they come collect, clean them up, and then all this is brass right here. And then they come and attach with this. So these are the, these are the bullet heads. Okay, so they have different calibers inside here. So they use them and they put them on the cartridges. So this is what it sells. That's the bullet right there. So this is the let me not muzzle you. Okay. This is a shadow. This Can you say a shadow? Top, what do you mean? This is a CZ shadow. This is one of the top guns we have in uh, all right. You see, I think in shooting sports, uh, your strength needs to be consistent. You don't need to have ups and downs. Uh, this is why, uh, for me, I don't start with too much caffeine, uh, because that, that is one of the reasons which I, gives me ups and downs. And you can also see I'm not doing too much starch. 
Uh, really, uh, when shooting, you need a lot of uh, external light in your body. So you need you lose a lot of energy, and your brain needs sugar. So it's very important that you have a healthy diet while going for a shoot. And also when shooting, you keep on at least having uh, some snacks, water. How's the shoot been, Mohammed? Ah, it has been wonderful. <laughs> uh, it was a nice experience. Mm -hmm. And uh, we wish to come back again. Okay, what's your I story? also met my brother here. Uh -huh. <laughs> come. And the, the, and the madam, the wife, uh -huh. right, Sad. he's wishing to, He's wishing... <laughs> Now, away from South Africa, let's get back to Kenya and head straight to the western region where uh, college games are set to begin in Bungoma and Bungoma North, a technical and vocation 